It is the soul's intention to know itself experientially, and thus to know me. For the soul understands that you and I are one, even as the mind denies this truth, and the body acts out this denial. Therefore, in moments of great decision, be out of your mind and do some soul-searching instead. The soul understands what the mind cannot conceive. You spend your time trying to figure out what's best for you. Your choices will be cautious. The decisions will take forever. And your journey will be launched on a sea of expectations. You are not careful. You will drown in your expectations. Whew, that's quite an answer. But how do I listen to my soul? How do I know what I'm hearing? The soul speaks to you in feelings. Listen to your feelings. Follow your feelings. Honor your feelings. <laughs> Why does it seem to me that honoring my feelings is precisely what has caused me to get into trouble in the first place? Because you have labeled growth trouble and standing still safe. I tell you this. Your feelings will never get you into trouble because your feelings are your truth. If you want to live a life where you never follow your feelings, but where every feeling is filtered through the machinery of your mind, go right ahead. Make your decisions based on your mind's analysis of the situation. But don't look for joy in such machinations, nor for celebration.